What is going on, my friends? Welcome back. And today we have ourselves another 510k eggs hatching. Last time was extremely depressing, really bad. This time we might get a little better luck. I'm aiming for currently still, okay? Snorlax, Dratini, Lapras, and I would also take as a consolation prize here, Kabudops, or not Kabudops, Kabuto, I'm sorry, and Ammonite, just so I can get Kabudops and I'm a star. So, five are ready to go. I have them lined up. Three, two, one, go! Oh, please be good though. Please don't fuck me over like last time. That was a really, really bad one last time. Oh, that's fucking awful. Uh, so Hitmonchan, why this is bad is because he has like a dedicated spawn in a lot of cities and everyone knows where he is all the time and you can go catch him whenever you want typically. That's why I'm not a big fan of Hitmonchan. So that's a really bad one. <laughs> and it has low CP, the fighting type. Hitmonchan, Hitmonlee, and Primeape all have really low CP values and not great move sets. So yeah, it's uh, not too awesome, unfortunately. Okay. Egg number two. We still have we still have four left. First one's bad. Four could be good. <sighs> Fucking pincer. Why do I get these so often? I have so many pincers, dude. 117 pincer candy. I don't think I've ever caught one. I think that means I've got like four hatches. Fuck pincer. Why did I get him, man? He's useless. His <laughs> Fury Cutter is an awful move. His CP is kind of low and he's a bug type. It's just like, uh. Come on, dude. Don't give me Pinsir. Don't give me Scyther. Don't give me Jinx either. Or Onyx. I don't want any of those. <laughs> Fucking Eevee! Of course it would be. Of course it would be. Well, we're going to have a chance to test this in a second because this is one of the theories is that when you get an Eevee from a 10 kilometer egg, you can name it Ditto and it might evolve into a Ditto. No idea if this works, but it's a theory because people think that Ditto is in the game currently and no one knows where he is. And the idea behind this is that Eevee is not really worth a 10k egg. Neither is Onyx, honestly, but we don't know why he's there. Um, but maybe that Ditto is transformed into one of the other Pokemon in the game and is hiding as that Pokemon. And the 10k Eevee is one of them. And I have a lot of candy. A 570 Eevee is useless anyway for me. I'd usually just transfer it. But let's evolve it and hopefully it goes into Ditto. No idea if this is right, by the way. I'm just doing it. It was a theory on Reddit. I heard about it as well. People think he's either hiding as this Eevee or possibly as a Pikachu as well, because in the show, he transformed into Pikachu first. All right. Well, not ditto. Okay. So that, that little theory busted. <laughs> I also tried uh, before with a friend last night naming it Duplica. And that might not make any sense if you don't know the show, but Duplica is the name of the trainer that had ditto. So it makes sense just because, you know, of how Rainer was working, Rainer and the other stuff. It made sense to do it like that, but unfortunately it was not useful in any way. And I don't need the Flareon, like I said, it's a very low CP rating for me. So I'm gonna just instantly transfer that one. Okay, egg number three, please be better. That's okay, that's better. I have an Aerodactyl. I caught one last night, actually. This one is a little bit stronger. Ancient power is mediocre and Steel Wing is okay. A 1200 Aerodactyl, that's slightly better. I'll take that. It's a little bit more frightening of an Aerodactyl at this point. Unfortunately, around here, I said, and I've showed you guys how many Eevees we catch, Vaporeon absolutely melts Aerodactyl. He's a rock flying type, as you can tell right there on the left-hand side of the screen. And so Vaporeon is super effective, and Vaporeon has really high damage moves and one of the top three Pokemon in the game. So, and it's a cheap evolve, so everyone has one. Unfortunately, Aerodactyl, as cool as he is, is not very useful for my area. We're going to hold on to him, of course, but... Yeah, we can't really put him in gyms and expect him to hold down the fort. Egg number four. Aerodactyl's not a bad one. That's not a loss. It's not a huge win, but it's not a loss. What is this one? Fucking Eevee again. Dude, come on. You guys see how much Eevee candy I have here, right? 234. I just evolved one, too. I don't need these Eevees. My Eevees that I catch right now at my level are like 800s. All right. Well, we have one egg. Oh, it's the last egg? Shit, I didn't count them correctly. That was horrible again. Dude, why is my luck so bad? That's depressing as shit. How do people get so lucky? I've had one Snorlax. You guys know how many eggs I've hatched? Check this out. I'll show you. Oops, not that, not that section though. This right here, eggs that I have hatched. If I can scroll down and look at my medals. Maybe I can't. 
It looks like they're not loading. Cool server, cool. <laughs> oh well, I guess nothing I can do about that now. That so sucks though, seriously. You get 10k eggs, you line up five of them and they're all garbage. Meanwhile, you have all these level 10s and 15s getting Lapras, Snorlax, Snorlax. They have like, it's like, oh, I got two Dratinis already. It's like a level 16. It's like, dude, I haven't had any of that shit. How the fuck are you getting it? You know? Whatever. We'll do it again in the future. We'll get some more. We'll see if we can grind out some more 10k eggs and hopefully get something decent. I wish I could see. I'm oh, here. I just loaded. I am at 337 eggs hatched. 337. I have had maybe 20 10 kilometer eggs. And of those 20, I have had one Snorlax. Never had a Lapras. Only one Ammonite. Never had a Kabuto. Like, I've had I've had five, four or five EVs, three Onyxes, like five Pinsers. The shittiest of the shit, in my opinion, because I already have them all, and they're not even good CP Pokemon. It's not like you get a bunch of Snorlaxes, which are like the second best in the game. Like, come on. You know, we want better stuff than that. We need a higher drop rate here, Niantic. Either way, like I said, we'll get some more in the future. We'll try it again, see if we can get some better luck. I need Dragonite, because I still suck and don't have one. If you'd like a Pokemon update right now, we hit 31 a little bit ago yesterday. And the top CPs, are there, we're already on it. We're good. All right, the Vaporeon, Lapras, Arcanine, a few Snorlaxes. Actually, I caught a third Snorlax last night. Well, it's not my third, but it's like a fifth, but where is it? Here it is, 1820. And this one's a little bit lower CP, but he has the correct move set for Body Slam. I would prefer Lick, Zen Headbutt's not bad, but I prefer Lick. Either way, this one will probably be boosted up to like the 2200 ratings as well, just because it has the right move set. And on top of that, we have a good Nidoqueen Queen now at 2100. We have the Golem we just evolved yesterday too at 1837 with a good move set of Mudshot. Really strong move. And at the same time, coming up in the near future, I don't know when, hopefully within the next few days, we'll do another video on this. I have, I'm gonna find it here. You're gonna, you're gonna like blow your mind. Watch a second, one second, one second. How far down is it? Here it is, boom. Oh, that's not it, this one. 216 Magikarp. This dude is gonna be an actual god. A god, I tell you. This will be like a 2400 Gyarados, hopefully. 2300. Either way, it's gonna be sick, and we're gonna evolve it. Thank you for watching though, bros. I will see you later. See you next time. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and I'm out for now. Bye-bye.